Welcome to my new series called How to Develop Charisma. In this series, we're going to talk about different kinds of ways that you could build charisma and you could help yourself to be a more charismatic person. The main thing as our introduction that I'd like, to, I'd like you to think about is to know what is charisma. What is the basic nature of a person being charismatic? If you think about all the charismatic people, why do you think usually other humans gravitate towards people who have charisma? Pe towards people who can manage themselves, manage their own emotions, control themselves, and present themselves as present themselves very well and present themselves as a person who can have a positive impact in the world. Well, the answer, if you think about it, is very simple. When a person is charismatic, that person is capable of leading a nation, leading a group, or leading the people around himself to a place which could be better than the present place. That's why you naturally gravitate towards a person who has charisma. Because you know if you go towards him, that person is going to lead you to a place which is better than your present place. And now I'm going to teach you how to be charismatic. Now that you know what builds charisma, what is the main purpose of charisma, now I'm going to teach you how you could be charismatic. The first principle of charisma, in my opinion, my personal opinion, is detachment from outcome. Detachment from outcome. Whatever you do, and no matter how hard you work for it, even if you go to an Olympic Games and you work your whole life in it, and if you lose, your reaction should be, it didn't matter anyways. So be absolutely detached from every single outcome. Work hard for it. Work very, very hard. Put your best effort in something. But the outcome doesn't matter. This is how you, th how you should think about all your achievements. Every single thing you do is to just do it. Just You do it because you want to do it, not because you care about the outcome. If you play chess, you play chess because you like to play chess. You don't care about if you lose or if you win. If you like investing, you do investing simply because you like investing. You don't care if you lose your money or not. If you go and do business, you only do it because you love the business, not because of the money you're going to earn from it. So this first principle of detachment from outcome gives you a core confidence while you live in your life. It gives you a core stability. stability. And since you're stable, since you have your inner ground is stable and you have a core confidence, now you're a person who can think better. Now you're a person who's relaxed while he's thinking. And when you are relaxed, when you think, you come up with ideas that are better, ideas that can be more useful and more impactful for the world. And this within itself builds a sense of charisma for you. And this sense of charisma will make other people to gravitate towards you. For the next episode, be tuned. I'll put that in the next episode. We'll talk about another principle, which is very important for building charisma.